and welcome back to the Texas Collection. We are here today for our tour part two with Jeannie, who's going to be showing us around the Pogue Mac Room. So Jeannie, can you just tell us a little bit about what you do here at the Texas Collection? Okay, well, I have just started working here, and in part, I am coordinating the regional history fair, and then I also have some responsibilities here in the Mac Room. Could you just tell us a little bit generally what the Mac Room is and how it fits into the Texas Collection? Sure. It is a special room, as you can see, with uh, lots of space for the collection, which is over 17,000 maps. Wow. And there's a huge range of maps that are in included. It, it big. Some of them go back to the 1500s. The focus is definitely on Texans, but we have the history of Texas, the exploration of Texas, the colonization oh of Texas, as well as much more recent highway maps and topographic maps and lots of local flavor as well. Wow, every time I visit a new place like this in the text collection, I hear exactly what we have. My mind is just yeah. like, <laughs> we have that here. Well, thank you so much for showing us around. We have to go down to the archives next, so I'll meet you there. So here we are in the Texas Collection archives. I'm here with Amanda, who's going to be showing us around a little bit. Amanda, could you just tell us a little bit about uh, what it is you do here? I am the university archivist, so all things Baylor history, administration, down to student organizations. Tell us a little bit about where we are. We are in uh, the stacks of the archives, the university archives, as well as the manuscript special collections uh, archives. I see that there are a ton of materials around us. Can you tell us a little bit about where they come from? Mostly uh, we'll have donations, family, or an organization that they're a part of, business or something like that is interested in uh, depositing their records here. When I first came to the Texas Collection, I was expecting a little more something looking like a museum or 3D objects, things like uniforms and uh, yeah. even guns. And, and not that I'm disappointed or anything, right. but it's just not that way. Right. Um, do you get a lot of people who think the same way? Yeah, the Texas Collection did used to have a lot of those sorts of materials. There came a point when you get to say, we are in archives and this is what we do. Thank you so much for showing us around the archives. Absolutely. Here we are with Jeff, who's going to be showing us around some of the photography that we have here at the Texas Collection. Jeff, could you tell us a little bit about what you do here at the Texas Collection? Sure. Um, my title here at the Texas Collection is Audio and Visual Curator. I work with photographs, audio items, tapes, uh, and various media and, and, and the audio section, and videos as well. We have over 1.5 million photographs. Wow. Uh, including uh, 35 millimeter negatives, uh, negatives of all various sizes, from 35 millimeter film to 8 by 10 glass plate negatives. We're digitizing those uh, as we speak, but photographs that are printed, such as these examples here, are ready for the patron to come and view. With over a million photos, how do you keep track of all of those? It's a daily job, constant. I almost want to say battle with indexing our collection and letting people know what we have. And that's the main goal of indexing your collection and getting the information out there so people know what we have. Photographed the collection, the Texas collection has digitized 5,000 images and they're on the Baylor website on Content DM, uh, hosted through the Riley Digitization Center. We've got tens of thousands more to go. So some are for immediate viewing at home. People interested in looking at the photographs can also come here and request photographs. Jeff, thank you so much for taking us on a tour of the photo collection and showing us such neat uh, photos of Waco that we have. I look forward to seeing you here at the Texas Collection. Thank you so much for joining us on this tour of the Texas Collection. Be sure to check out our channel next week for another video. Remember to like, comment, subscribe, and share this video if you liked it. See you next week!